the topic of this video is entering solutions to linear systems in my math lab. At the bottom of every linear systems problem in my math lab, you're going to have to choose between three options when entering your answers. Remember that there are three possible outcomes for linear systems, one solution, infinitely many solutions, and no solution. So let's say you have exactly one solution to your system. That means you have a value for X and you have a value for Y. Therefore, when you enter this in my math lab, you will choose option A and you will place the value for X inside the box that follows X equals and the value for Y in the box that follows Y equals. Let's say you're solving your system and you determine that there are infinitely many solutions. Then you're going to select option B. Take either of the two original equations and solve them for the variable specified here. Sometimes it will say x equals, sometimes it will say y equals. Whatever it says here is what you should solve for, and then fill in the other side of the equation. The third possibility is that there is no solution to the system, in which case you're going to choose answer choice C, the system is inconsistent and has no solution. 